vlog i am going to make a granola right now and i thought that i would film it because i am positive that it's gonna turn out really great i've never made a homemade granola before my mom usually makes them and i love her granola but she makes it with like a lot of nuts and seeds and it's like super healthy i will definitely share that recipe one day though because it really tastes amazing and like my best friend is obsessed with it but i've been craving this like almond butter granola because i was at this juice bar the other day and their granola is so delicious and i know some of the ingredients so i'm gonna try to recreate it and like add my little touch to it so yeah but it's gonna be like an almond butter hazelnut granola and i'm so stoked to make it also because i've kind of been looking for some new breakfast recipes kind of over my chia puddings because i've just been eating them on repeat still love them but i don't want to eat them every day so i thought that granola would be a really nice option so yeah let's make it okay so i put everything out that we're gonna need for the granola um little overview we're gonna use oats maple syrup a little bit of salt coconut oil flax seeds almond butter cacao nibs walnuts and i'm gonna use some hazelnuts but you guys you can replace a lot of the stuff if you don't want it like you could replace the walnuts with pumpkin seeds and so on um but this is just the recipe that i'm going to be making tonight I think that I have a new addiction. I haven't even tried this yet, but I just know that it's gonna be good. Um, by the way, what I wanted to say is that I forgot to add flax seeds. Those, I mean, it's optional, obviously, but I did want to add them just to have some extra fiber. I forgot though, but I just wanted to say that in case you guys want to add those because I think that it's like a nice addition. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna clean up this mess and then flip the granola and then wait for it to cool down. I'm honestly not patient for that. I'll probably start eating it whilst it's still hot, which you shouldn't do. Okay, you guys, the granola is done. This is what it looks like. And I'm just going to sprinkle some cacao nibs on top. You could also do chocolate chips, but I kind of want mine to be a little healthy. That should be enough. And I'm just going to let this cool down and then break it into little pieces, even though they already kind of broke into these 
little things um, whilst I flipped it over but yeah this was so much easier <laughs> to make than I thought it would be but I kind of want to try a little piece this piece is calling my name let's do a taste test I feel like I'm gonna burn my tongue if I eat it now because it's hot but I cannot wait don't do this at home kids Hot. Mm. Mm. Wow, this is so good. I can definitely taste the almond butter. Please try it out and let me know if you did because everyone deserves to taste this. Also, does anyone else get super red skin in the wintertime? I think it's because of the heating. I don't know if you can tell on camera, but my cheeks tend to get super red um, during the winter. But yeah. I'm gonna let this cool down I'm gonna probably have it for breakfast tomorrow but I have to study now so I'll catch up with you guys on another day you guys I I couldn't resist I have to try it it cooled down a little bit it's on the warmer side but it's basically cold let's do a taste test I added some oat milk but I feel like this would be also really good with some steamed milk but yeah mm-hmm I love the taste of it. It tastes super nice, but I think that I put it in the oven for a little bit too long. At least like the edges. The middle of the granola actually still tastes very nice, but the edges kind of, I don't know, were in there for like too long. Maybe like a minute or two. Nothing crazy. But overall, this is so good. I just finished my morning writing meditation about gratitude i've been loving that so much i've have the um 14 day trial for the superhuman app because i'm a really big fan of mimi bouchard and she always raves about it about her app so i just thought that i would try it out i don't really know if i'm gonna like get a subscription or not yet but we're just using the free trial for now and I've been loving some of the meditations on that app. I highly recommend you guys to try out the free trial as well. Um, just to see if it's something for you. And yeah, I am going to make some breakfast right now. I have this really nice breakfast idea in my mind. And I really hope that it's going to taste nice. But I thought of doing like a Greek yogurt granola bowl with frozen raspberries. Which are heated up so they're like melted. And I don't know, my mind it sounds so good, but we're gonna try it out right now and see if it actually is as good as I think it will be. Um, so yeah, it's Saturday today by the way, and I have plans with my sister later on. I um, also really want to clean my room, want to edit and upload a video, and I also want to get some stuff done for school, so it's a full day. But I'm excited. I slept so good yesterday. Um, but yeah, let's try out this breakfast.
actually so good. It's exactly what I imagined that this would taste like. You have to try this out. It's so, so nice. so needed i honestly notice a difference in my mood when my room isn't organized so i just thought that i would tackle it now usually i do it on sundays if i clean during the weekends but it's a saturday and it was much needed so we did it anyways um and i also took off my sheets so they need to be washed today and um yeah i'm loving the clean floor especially i don't know why this water bottle is randomly sitting here Anyways, I am waiting for my sister to arrive. She's usually always on time, but I think that she allowed herself to be late because I'm always late when we hang out, so karma, but it's okay. Guess who showed up? <laughs> <laughs> you guys, we just came back from the grocery store. Got a couple of things. I'm gonna add a couple of things, and we're making pokey balls. I've been craving this for so long, I'm super excited, so we're just gonna kind of show you how it's done. <laughs> Welcome to my cooking show. see but like what the fuck is this And 
veggies are done. My sister whipped up something with these edamame my beans. We made the best out of a very sad situation. <laughs> and now we're gonna cup it really perfectly. This is so unnecessary, but it just makes everything a lot nicer. But thank you, was really like this. I know, but it's so pretty. Okay. <laughs> We are such nice children. And that was it for our cooking show. Hope you guys enjoyed. Like, follow, and subscribe for more. My camera's blinking. Perfect timing. Love you guys. See you tonight. Mwah. <laughs> All right, you guys. My sister and I are going out. It's literally the sun is almost setting. It's insane. No, I'm vlogging. <laughs> okay. Well, hi. You can in be included. Thank um, you. my sister and I are going for a walk. Now I forgot what I wanted to say. Sorry. We're going for a walk and then she's going to go to the gym and I'm not going to because I can't even lift my arm because I have such bad like muscle ache, pain, what do you call it? I have a muscle ache or my muscles are in pain, whatever. My happen. muscles are in pain because I trained a muscle that I usually don't train and that's why it hurts so much. But we're going to go for a walk and then hopefully I can go to the gym tomorrow. Um, but yeah, these are the fits. <laughs> Show us. My fit is so inadequate. This looks so weird. Maybe you should put your whole fit on and come back. Okay, I will. So, I'm wearing my mom's sweater. It's just like a gray cashmere sweater. It's super, super soft. Um, then I'm wearing my trousers from Philippa K. I'm wearing new balances. And then just my puffer over it. My sister's wearing the exact opposite. Yeah, you, like you can explain now if you want. <laughs> I'm wearing a tracksuit from H&M. And the scarf's from Urban Outfitters, question mark. The coat I got from my grandma, actually. Love my grandma. I also have so many clothes from her. She's the best. <laughs> <laughs> but it's from CNA. Okay. And my Uggs are from Ugg. Oh, really? <laughs> I wouldn't have guessed that. You know this ain't the time for the two of us. Ooh, I ain't got space. Thinking about oh, you no doubt am I thinking Me and you Guess it's over It was a rainbow But we're sinking Lost my you I might come running back When our hearts get back on track When the stars line up That's that I've been attached Just looking out We moved so fast Was moving south My secret sauce Move in and out Miss how you gloss That pretty mouth next day it's sunday today and i'm actually gonna go to uni right now to study on campus because my friend and i did this a couple of weeks ago and we loved it because the entire campus is empty like there's only a couple of students that study and it's just such a vibe and we really enjoyed it so we're doing it again today because also we need to catch up on some courses and want to study so we're gonna do that hopefully i'll be productive it's 11 o'clock right now i'm gonna leave um and yeah i just prepared myself this looks so cute i just prepared myself um a little lunch for later on because the cafeteria is closed in the weekends obviously so i made myself a little poke bowl with the leftovers from yesterday and then i can eat that but yeah i'm gonna take you guys along with me and try to film some clips over there just arrived at uni we are gonna do this
you guys. This is my current setup. I have the entire computer room to myself. It's honestly so, so nice. And I'm going to be working with the Pomodoro method. I know if you guys are familiar with this, but basically you get like 25 minutes to study, then you get a five minute break, then you continue with the 25 minutes and you do that like four times. And then after you've done that, you get a long break of 15 minutes or 30, you can adjust it, I think. Um, but yeah, this has been proven to like optimize your concentration so i love using this if you guys want to use it as well you just have to go to this website i can also put it in a description um and yeah let's start <laughs> tripod so deal with this ugly angle please we just came back from the grocery store to get some snacks because it's already getting pretty late so little haul i got olives basil olives i got a vitamin water and i got some oh there's a hole oh my god i got some croissants Amazing. And my friend got carrots, a hummus stick, and a wrap because she didn't have a proper lunch. What time is it even? It's five o'clock. So I think that I'm gonna go home in like two hours, around seven, because I do want to have my dinner at home. But yeah, we're gonna have a little break and then continue. And then continue studying. Hello, you guys. I'm back home. It's a lot later. It's um, 10 o'clock actually. I came home and I just had dinner with my family and then I chilled and watched Grownish. I'm still watching it right now. You know, gotta have balance in life. I was also snacking on this really nice cinnamon roll. Just finished that so I forgot to show you. But yeah, I just thought that I would end up this vlog tomorrow. It's Monday so I'm gonna start a new vlog for the new week. Um, and yeah, I don't know. I just have been really getting back into vlogging and enjoying it so much. I felt like I was kind of in a YouTube rut like the past couple of months ever since I started uni. Um, because it was kind of hard for me to find a good balance. But now I feel like I found that balance and it makes me so happy. And I've also been in such a good mental state lately because of some things that I've been doing. But I'm going to talk more about that in my next vlog because I also don't want this vlog to be too long. Um, but yeah. Thank you all so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up. Make sure to put it on my post notifications to be notified when I upload. And also one thing I wanted to say, I always forget to say this, but if you guys want to see more of like the day-to-day -day things I do in my life when I'm not vlogging, make sure to follow me on Instagram because I have been posting more stories about like little recipes that I've been trying out that I really enjoy. Just thought I'd mention that in case you guys are interested in my Instagram content as well. My Instagram handles are the same as my YouTube, so life by Sila. Um but yeah I'm gonna finish this grownish episode by the way. Highly recommend that show you guys. It's on Disney Plus and it's super nice. Um and then I'm gonna go to bed because I have a morning class tomorrow. But yeah thank you all so much for watching. I will see you guys next week.